Hey, cute people. It's, what, Wednesday? And we're, like, what, 14 days into the new year? So I hope you're all enjoying it. Yeah. I wanted to do this video Monday when I got my um curl kit in the mail. But I wasn't feeling up to it. And I really wasn't feeling up to doing anything today. But... So why not? I miss talking to you guys. Even though I can't see you, I still miss talking to you guys. But I want to show you what came in the kit without keeping you too very long in case you have not come across one of Curl Kit's January unboxings as of yet. Please take note that um, I'll have in the description box below a link where you can receive 10% off of your purchase of anything with curl kit whether it's a curl kit um, subscription the first box only and or any other purchases you may want to make with curl kit because remember they sell other things now. well they always have but just remember that the first thing I always take a look at when you open the box you see the curl life which is the curl kit publication which is so cute and they have a really pretty model on here. It looks like she's a throwback from the 70s. I don't know if you can see that really well. Hopefully you can. Am I doing a good job of showing you? Okay, I think that might be better. So that was what was inside. And inside there's something about shedding tips, cold weather, um, hair tips, and all that other good stuff. So when you open up the kit, it looks a little something like this. There's some interesting things in here, but I'm not sure if there's anything I'm excited about. The first thing I wanted to look at was this item here because I was like, oh no, not the shampoo again. Even though I like the shampoo, but I want to try something different. But this is the Luscious Locks Curl Enhancer. It's infused with aloe vera and olive oil. And you know it's free of a whole bunch of bad stuff. Stuff you don't want to put in your hair. And um, it smells pretty much like the shampoo in their hair mask. And I opened it. It was locked up, but so it smells really good. I'm not really sure if I care about using it, but since the other two products from Luscious Locks um, surprised me, I'll definitely, definitely look forward to trying this here. Something else I saw, I was like, okay, what is this? It's from um, Amazing, Amazing Botanicals. It's their Honey Cunt Dish. It's a leave-in and a moisturizing styler. It comes in this jar here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And it smells real flowery, very perfumey. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's one item. Something else that I saw in the box, I've never heard of these people, which is Curls Are Us. Very, very um, simple name. It's their Curl Definer. It is paraben, paraben and silicone free. It protects and defines your curls. And it looks a lot like that. Mm -hmm. This, I guess, would be a deluxe sample. I guess, I don't know, maybe it's the full size and it's four ounces of product. Really nice, light scent. Won't beat you over the head. But they say apply to a small amount in the palm of your hand at work. Can you see what it says? Working evenly through wet or damp hair in style as usual. So that's this product here by Curls R Us. Very original name, right? And then there was a product from Giovanni, which I think we all love. And this is their Too Chic Avocado and Olive Oil Oyster Moist Conditioner for Dry or Damaged Hair. And that looks like so. Deluxe sample. I don't smell anything um, at all, but I'm looking forward to trying that. Seems like it'll definitely be something to look forward to. 
and um, definitely look out for it in the stores. This here was open and all over my stuff when I got it, but it was just a little bit so I still have enough that I can use. And it's from Wonder Curl. It's their restoring hair treatment. It's an intensive deep hair treatment that strengthens, moisturizes, and soothes your hair from Wonder Curl. And it looks a little lot like this. <laughs> I'm not gonna open it, but it um was very very creamy i'm going to use this as a matter of fact the next time i wash my hair because they put it in this pop i don't know if you can see they put it in this pop top you just pop the top up and it'll be open for all the stuff to just spill out all over everywhere so i can't see myself sticking it with the rest of my stash because my stash is just all over the place and just wasn't working there. So before I lose it, I'm going to use it. And I'm not going to open it now because it'll be all over the place because stuff is up on the top. They could have did better with that. And those were the items that were in the box. Now remember, I told you that um, I'll have a link to um, a coupon code. So do check that out if you want to make a purchase. And it doesn't just have to be a curl kit. But also in the... Um, Kit came this here, and it's so funny. Just the other night, I think I got this on Monday. That Sunday night, I was watching a video by a young lady. If I can remember her name and come across it again, um, "Death to Pillow Packs" was the title of her video, and she is so right. Um, how you get these pillow packs and you can't do anything with it and this is what she was talking about and then we get it in the curl kit and it's so true what can you do with these little packets now they send here the coconut curling cream okay this is it this is the pack the curling cream which is very cute I think we got a sample of this in a um, curl kit but don't quote me but I think so so it's a curling cream, but what are you going to do with it? You can't do much with it. Um, maybe smell it and just see what it looks like. But they did give you a coupon. And as we know, a lot of us like their leave-in conditioner, which I really do like. So this will definitely come in handy. $2 off? Yes. So that is it. That is all. I came in the... First box of the year for 2014, Curl Kit, January box. I have to say, I'm glad that I got the box in good condition, that this uh, Wonder Curl didn't mess up everything. It did get on some stuff. But um, I can't say there's anything that I am so overwhelmingly eager to try. I have these things, so of course I will try them. Um, I'll put them on my... When I get a chance to get around to using them list, which is growing every month. I haven't bought anything for here. I don't plan on it. But um, I have so much. I think that um, my days with Curl Kit are about to come to an end. I think I'm going to give them another month or two and then I'll make my final decision. Because I have so much. I can't use up all this stuff in my lifetime. I did a giveaway recently. I'm going to go through my stuff and see what I have available and, and have another giveaway. Um... Because I need to give away some stuff. <laughs> so I'm going to end this video here right now. Because like I said, there's always something to do. I think right now for me, I am going to just chill out since I'm home. And relax and have a good day. And think about tomorrow when I have to get out of the house. And that's it. But I just want to... Um, Thank you for stopping by and watching this video. And hopefully I'll see you in the next. And I just want you to share and spread love. Oh, let me say before I tell you to share and spread love, which I already did. If you were looking at my fingernail polish, which my nails look horrid. This red color I have on here. It's by Sinful Colors. I love this color. I wouldn't normally wear it now or wear this because it's so vibrant in the summertime. But the last couple of days here in New York have been so dark and dreary. I wanted something bright on my fingers. I wanted something bright on my lips today, but I wasn't really going too far. So 
This is called Ruby Ruby Sun um sin, Sunflower. Oh, I'm saying sinful colors. It's so pretty. I like it. I like it. I messed it up and I put another coat on and I think I messed it up again. But on my lips too. Now this is a limited edition, but I have seen it in the store um in my neighborhood right a like about a week ago. And this is in January. So I guess if you really just happen to bump into it and you want to pick it up. This here is called Chocolate. The writing is so tiny, tiny, but I think it does say chocolate. But um, it's really, really a nice dark color when I put it on my lips. You see how it comes out dark? But of course, then we... Well, that's what it looks like and I gotta start taking my B12 again because my lips are peeling I haven't been taking the vitamins in a couple of days and my lips just wreck havoc but um listen I gotta go you do too so now share and spread love hey cute people subscribe to my channel and check out my last three videos if you missed them also, I'm on Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram as Ebony Girl Speaks. Facebook, I'm Ebony Girl Speaks Naturally.